going on, Ron? They were here for you. Here for you. Who was here? Them bikers. After you killed Johnny K? And they damage my stuff, huh? They smash up my home, damage my soul. This, 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 this statue here of impotent rage, this fucking meant more to me than Johnny K meant to anyone, and they smashed it. Those pathetic, midlife crisis, hog-riding, shaven-headed, fruity leather, chapped-wearing fucking assholes. They're assholes, Trevor. They are. They're chap wearing assholes. Oh, wait, 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 you little shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, Michael fucking Townley, right? Bitch wife, two kids, 45. Find them. Go Santos. It's a big, big place, Trevor. There's lots of people. You are fucking useless. Huh? Find out who did that fucking robbery, all right? And if Michael Townley lives there or anyone matching his description, I'm going to kill you and your fucking cousin. Am I being clear now? Yes, Trevor. Thank you. Now smile. Yeah. Uh -huh. All right? That's bad. Don't know. Look. Now, Ron. Shall we go? I cannot believe that they fucking destroyed my statue of infinite rage. The cheek! Huh? The fucking cheek. I got a swing by ammunition. Go to Sandy Shores Airfield. Check it out. I'll come in your ear when I get a hold of you. Oh, what are you buying at the gun shop? I'm not buying anything. I need a sniper rifle with a high-power scope. They say they support local business. Well, we're about to find out if that's true. Melvin! How you feel about brand synergy, huh? TP Industries. Ammunition. Good, because you're about to make a corporate gift of a rifle, a high-powered scope, and a suppressor. Uh, take whatever you want, Trevor. I can't afford another fire. That's the rifle I need. She'll do nicely. Now I need a scope and a suppressor. They won't hear me coming. All right, now stop selling weapons to that half-wit Cletus. That's a good price for what you're getting there. The penis substitute selection. Slots perfectly under the car seat.
think the last time I cleaned this place, there was another president in power. I'm trying to remain enthusiastic, but I don't really care if you buy it or not. For when a black eye just <laughs> isn't enough. I think that you made the right choice. Enjoy. I got the gun. Meet me at the water tower just north of the airfield. Roger that, Trevor. But you gotta look out, because there's bikers all over this airstrip. Of course there are! Two planes are touching down at the field on a weapons run. We're gonna wait till the right time and appropriate them. We are? Yes, we are. Where are you, man? I'm waiting at the water tower. I'm up here. I don't see the hardware. But I do see a hell of a lot of bikers. I'm up the tower, Trevor. We gotta wait till you can slip in there unnoticed. Should give you the time to plan a route to the gas tank you're rigging up to blow. The time is right. Go on, my son. Whenever you get a doubt in your mind, I want you to remember that I'm watching you through the scope of a high-powered rifle. Right, Trevor. Right, right. Got it. Now, relax. The ATV can only take you so far. Park it and don't let them spot you. Can you see me, Trevor? Here, by the road. You wouldn't believe this, Ron. One of these assholes is having a seizure or something. That's me. Well, get a move on! I'm moving! Just keep me covered, okay? Hold up! There's a guard standing under the control tower! Good kill, Trevor! You're walking like you shot yourself! Move! And there's the other. You got him! Now don't shoot the guy in the van until he stops and gets out. All fire. We gotta see what he's up to. I think he's just calling the dead guy. You can erase him now. He's out of the van now. Do it! You should have seen the look on his face. There's a guy coming out of the control tower. Take him out! Shit! So long, sailor. Oh no! Bottom of the tower. Another guy's on his way. He's down there, amongst the bodies. 
Clean shot, Trev. Another guy's coming out of the tower. Must be looking for the one you shot. Woo! Down he goes. Can you get your sights back on me? Come on, man. Get your sights on me, man. I can't move till I'm covered. I got you in my sights, so get a move on and plant that bomb on the gas tank. I'm on it, but there's a guy coming out of that building, I think. I can hear him. Shoot! The guy had a buddy in the building! He's coming out! He's seen the body! Take him out before he raises the alarm! Good kill, Trevor! Chopper, just fucking drive! You're bikers! It's looking for us, T! We ain't gonna get them guns when they got tactical superiority! If I hit the chopper, everyone's gonna know we're here! Try and hit the pilot when he's settled! They might think he crashed! Might they? They might! to the best of us. Now start that plane. I hope there's enough of these guns to go around. Shouldn't we go find the guys who came to the trailer? No, we should secure this fucking hardware.
Everything's loaded up with crates, Trevor! Just like you said! The rest of the guns must be on the plane down the end of the runway. Vamos, go! Get me to that plane! Time to trigger those explosives on that gas tanker! Get me to my plane, Rod! The guy who's taking receipt of these guns is in a boat just off the coast. Hey, there's a biker on your wing, Trevor. I am aware of this. Well, you gotta get him off. Do a roll or something. Oh, there he goes. Finally, I feel safe. So, uh, who might this buyer be? There's only two places this kind of hardware is gonna go. And they are? Up north to our Canadian cousins, where the lost were likely to be sending them. Or our other neighbors, those in the south, our Mexican brethren. I assume you got all kinds of connections in Canada. Why would you make an assumption like that? It's obvious. Why is it obvious? Spell it out for me before I order you to fly that plane into a mountain. Um, well, because of where you used to operate. Weren't you pulling scores in North Yankton and running cargo over the border? Oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah sure I was. I see a signal. You think that's your guy? That's him. Let's do it. Fort Sankudo coming up. If we fly low, we ain't gonna show up on military radar. Successfully delivered, Ron. Now remember, if you beat me to the airstrip, I'll butcher your carcass and wrap you in cheesecloth. You wouldn't really do that to me, would you? Beat me and you'll see. Uh, I ain't a trained Air Force pilot like you. I can just about get where I'm going, but I don't got much choice over whether it's fast or slow. Then get better at it, or fly through a barn. Would a barn slow me down? Yeah, it might do. Or it might kill you instead. I'm just gonna fly normal, and I'll rely on you getting there quicker. You're braver than I thought. Keep low, over the swamp, boss. So the guns are going to Mexico? 
Mexico. Yeah, guy in the boat is Oscar Guzman. He's in with the cartels. If there's a market... This could be a way to expand the business. Like I hadn't thought of that? We might be able to buy into Oscar's thing, but leave that to me, Ron. I'm sorry to ask this, but does your contact pay well for this kind of shipment? Because I've got those lawyer fees for the divorce and my settlement costs. Oh, he pays. Better than any in this sorry country. <laughs> That's good to hear, man. We'll talk about the exact split when we're grounded, okay? All right. Shipment successfully delivered, Ron. Now remember, if you beat me to the airstrip, I'll butcher your carcass and wrap you in cheesecloth. You wouldn't really do that to me, would you? Beat me and you'll see. Uh, I ain't a trained Air Force pilot like you. I can just about get where I'm going, but I don't got much choice over whether it's fast or slow. Then get better at it, or fly through a barn. Would a barn slow me down? Military base coming up. Fly low. We don't want to show on their radar. Stay low over those wetlands, boss. So the guns are going to Mexico? Mexico, yeah. Guy in the boat is Oscar Guzman. He's in with the cartels. If there's a market, this could be a way to expand the business. Like I hadn't thought of that? We might be able to buy into Oscar's thing, but leave that to me, Ron. I'm sorry to ask this, but does your contact pay well for this kind of shipment? Because I've got those lawyer fees for the divorce and my settlement costs. Oh, he pays. Better than any in this sorry country. <laughs> That's good to hear, man. We'll talk about the exact split when we're grounded, okay? All right, T. I think that was adequate restitution for my impotent rage statue. That was a mighty fine statue, Trev. That was a mighty fine piece of plastic shit. But there is no price for emotional attachment. I mean, you might forego your cut to uh, alleviate my heartache. I might? Yeah, I mean, I will. Good idea. We don't have time to dwell on that now. Because we got more runs, Ron. If there is one thing that they need south of that big fence, it is guns. <laughs> Trevor Phillips Industries. Technical expertise, hmm? managerial innovations, unstoppable. Oh, that's right. Now go. I need to meditate. Or masturbate. Or both. <laughs> 